Hey guys, thanks for watching Cheap Shot. Uh, I got my Beretta A300 Outlander Sporting Chokes here. Um, I have an extra one that I bought for some skeet shooting. Um, I lose these all the time, hence why I duct taped them together. I got a little pencil here for when I'm at the range and whatnot, but I lose them all the time. So I figured, what the heck, why don't we uh, 3D print a little case for all these? We'll have some embedded magnets in there to actually hold these in. Maybe the lid will sit on top and the uh, magnets will take and hold the lid on top of it. Let's figure it out. I was planning on doing a video where uh, I actually show you how I make it in CAD and 3D print it and whatnot, but I figured it'd probably be about 45 minutes long and no one wants to see that. So uh, enjoy this little montage. All right, so here's the case. Overall, I'm quite happy with it. Lid holds on nice with the magnets. We have magnets embedded here, here, as well as here on these lips right here. Magnets inside of each chamber around right there. Just hold the chokes in. And uh, overall, I'm quite pleased with it. I like that it sits over there like that. Didn't plan it for it to do that, but it, uh, it works. Fits in there. Not a lot of slide. So, uh, you know, we have a little bit of defects right there, kind of some wear lines from where I paused it, but uh, that's all right. Overall, I'm quite happy with it. Uh, let me know if there's anything that you would change about this. Um, if you have a 3D printer and you have these chokes, a link for the part will be down in the description so you can make it yourself if you like to. Uh, but please let me know if you like these 3D printing videos and if you'd like me to do a little bit more of them. Thanks for watching Cheap Shot.